Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. To replace the ice auger motor assembly in the Samsung refrigerator, you will need a Phillips head screwdriver, a large flathead screwdriver, and a small flathead screwdriver. Before you begin the procedure, unplug the appliance's power cord. Open the left side refrigerator door and pull out the ice bucket. Using the Phillips head screwdriver, unthread the screw securing the ice wire harness cover. With the screw unthreaded, you can pull the cover straight out to remove. Depress the tabs to disconnect the wire harness connector. Next, unthread the screw securing the lower ice maker cover. Use the large flathead screwdriver to depress the retaining tab to release the cover. Use the screwdriver to help detach the refrigerant tubing from the bottom of the ice maker. Now depress the retaining tab at the top and pull the ice maker assembly forward and down to remove. This may require some effort. Next, use the small flathead screwdriver to depress the retaining tab to disconnect the auger wire harness connector. Insert the large flathead screwdriver under the auger motor assembly retaining clip, then rotate to lift up the clip. You can now pull the old assembly out. To install the new ice auger motor assembly, align it in the housing and push it back until it locks into place. Connect the auger wire harness connector. Reposition the ice maker assembly in the housing so the refrigerant tubing feeds through the space between the ice maker tray and the hinged lower cover. Then align the slots on the housing mounting posts and push back until the assembly is fully seated. Press the refrigerant tubing into place under the tray and close the cover. Rethread the screw to secure the cover. Connect the ice wire harness connector and secure all wiring behind the clips. Realign the tabs on the wire harness cover with the slots in the ice maker housing and push the cover straight back. Thread the screw to secure. Replace the ice bucket. Plug the power cord back in and the refrigerator should be ready for use.